When you talk about rivalries, things don't get much closer than Geraldine and Sylvania. The schools are only 20 miles apart and they've been squaring off on the gridiron since 1947 and the series is nearly evenly split. The Rams and Bulldogs already met once this year in a 41-24 win for Sylvania. But now it's do or die in DeKalb County in our playoff game of the week. It's been a wild year for the Rams with 10 different starters missing at least one game, but the next man up mentality has helped power them to this point and overcoming adversity is what they're all about. When bad things happen, it doesn't matter next play. When good things happen, it doesn't matter next play because it doesn't matter what happened to play before, whether good, bad, ugly, you got to play the next one. Our guys have done a really good job of that. In Geraldine, they're painting the town purple and head coach Michael Davis is hoping to give them a reason to keep it going this Friday. The community's excited, you know, that's what it's all about, getting the community excited, giving our, some, you know, our community something to be proud of, and our guys, they take pride in that. Even though they met earlier this year, these squads have grown a lot since September, and both coaches expect it'll be a true battle. I'm so excited for our guys, like um, our players. We have a huge opportunity here in front of us, and no matter what, the DeKalb County School's moving on to the semifinals, and hopefully it's Sylvania, but uh, it's going to be a, a great matchup and a good football game on Friday. You know, just to come out here and play and, and do what they're doing, seeing their hard work pay off, man, you, you love it for them. That brings me more joy than anything, seeing those guys, the, the smile on their faces after wins, you know, that's what it's all about. In DeKalb County, Max Cohan, Way 31 Sports.